Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Hopkinton High School. We are underway. It is boys varsity soccer on HCAM television. The Holliston Panthers and the Hopkinton Hillers. Holliston in the red jerseys. Hopkinton, of course, in the white. And we have started first half play at field 13. It is a Go, Jake. Pretty Go. nice atmosphere here for soccer. Weather a little bit muggy, but cool breezes coming in on occasion. And clouds in the air, but no rain expected. As the Hillers defending their zone, the Panthers being aggressive early on, trying to work their way in. And we'll get you the starters in just a moment. Good ball Go, distribution by the Hillers. And now here comes Halston on the attack. That one is put out of bounds past the end line. Hillers will get a chance to clear it out. Let's take a look at the Hillers starters. You have Tyler Zanini, the goalkeeper. Nate Pucci is on defense. Connor Delaney is a forward. Justin Normando on defense. Ooh, Michael Pavakad, a midfielder. Peyton Burns, a forward. Owen Delaney, a midfielder. Tim Fargiano is a midfielder. Nick Skiba on defense. Nice. Matt Lind, a midfielder. And Philip McCarthy on defense. Hiller's set to throw it in. Nice. Throw in from the near side. Hopkinton working right up. to left across the screen. A bicycle kick there. That one put out of bounds. Throw in for Holliston. And here come the Panthers back on the attack. Now with possession is Dylan Kasarjian. We'll get the uh, Holliston starters in a moment as well. Hillers having to defend their zone for the majority of this game so far. Panthers set to clear it away. Jake Heisel, the goalkeeper in his junior year, will give it a boot. That one just the past the reach of Skiba. Now towards the near side and put out of bounds. It will be a Hiller's throw in. We'll have a stoppage for substitutions. Pair of Panthers coming into the game. Evans Dohan as well as Jake Pecht into the game for Holliston. Tom Nappy on the call, Matt Clark on camera for this broadcast of Hopkinton Hillers Boys Varsity Soccer. Our first game of the year at Field 13, our first broadcast. The Hillers have played a couple games here so far. They are Two and three on the season. Holliston four and one. A nice start to the year for the Panthers. That one put out of bounds on the near side. It's a throw in for Holliston. Panthers led by head coach James Lavasser. And of course the Hillers led by head coach Garrett Sawyer. Both coaches have done nice jobs with these respected TVL programs. Tyler Zanini gets rid of it to the far side. Hillers trying to work their way into Holliston territory and establish some momentum. They are having all kinds of trouble getting any kind of momentum going in the offensive zone. Throw in for the Panthers. From the near side, it's James Ryan Cober. There's Dohan. Now over to Katz, into the box. The header by the defender, Pucci. Nice job by Pucci, keeping it out of the danger zone there. As the sun starts to peek out now in this first half of play, we are about five minutes in, scoreless game between the Hillers and Panthers. Here comes Hopkinton, tripped at midfield there. Lost his footing a little bit. And Hollison now on the attack. 
Apucci being put to work on the defensive side. There's Skiba putting it out of bounds along the sideline. Panthers will have it. Jake Ryan Cober, the senior defender, will throw it in. There it is, right into the box. Good placement there, but the Hiller is stacking the box with defenders, and it pays off. Nice job by Andrew Keeley staying in front, and then Tim Fargiano clearing it away. Out of bounds along the near side. Throw in for the Hillers. Here comes Holliston once again. And we apologize, we had some uh, early audio difficulties, but we have since been able to fix the problem. Our first broadcast of the season was the first game for the Hillers boys and girls teams. It was a doubleheader against Ashland. We partnered up with WACA-TV to bring you those games. You can find those on our YouTube page as well as the WACA-TV YouTube page, the Ashland Community Station. And they will also be airing on the HCAM channels. Panthers working back into the Hillers defensive zone. Nicely defended by Fargiano. Along the near side, Delaney. Here he comes down the sideline. Pair of Panthers in front of him. That's taken away. As Evan Katz able to get to it. Now put up into the Hiller zone by John Pecht. There's a header out in front by Normando. Ivar Metapor, pass over to the circle. Now up to Kasarjian. Dylan Kasarjian rushing in hard and got tangled up there with Normando. He's down in a bit of pain, but is quick to get back to his feet. Kasarjian, a multi-sport athlete for Holliston. Here comes the Hillers. Delaney along the sideline has it stolen away, and then a body check there. That'll draw a whistle. Jake Ryan Cober stole it away on a good defensive play. And a check there will draw the whistle and a free kick for Holliston. And one of the Panthers players having a few words with the official is Jake Ryan Cober. Up into the box, wrapped up by the goaltender. Come on, Red, let's go, boys. Tyler Zanini, the sophomore, has done a nice job in net this season for the Hillers. He will clear it away. Back into the Holliston zone it goes. Now the Panthers having to defend a little here. Goalkeeper will take care of that one. Goalkeeper Jake Heisel airs it out. Back in the Hillers defensive territory now. There's Pavaka getting a foot on it. Normando launches it into Holliston territory and that'll be put out of bounds on a slide by Tyler Cotting. But there was a whistle, so this is going to go in favor of the Panthers, I believe. And it indeed will. Free kick for Holliston. The goalkeeper, Jake Heisel, showing off the strong leg. All the way into the box it goes. Here comes Holliston, an opportunity here right at the goalkeeper. A strong shot by John Pecht. Nicely wrapped up by Zanini. And 
Into Holliston territory. Up the near side is Metaport. Put out of bounds by Normando. A few substitutions before the throw in. About 29 minutes, 30 seconds left to go in this first half of play. Panthers on a throw in. Strong throw right into the box and that was blooped up in the air and wrapped up by Zanini. The goalkeeper will get rid of it. In the Holliston territory, header by Cotting. Pass to the left side of the box. That one put towards the sideline by Ryan Kober and out of bounds it goes. Hiller's throw in. And her back towards the sideline. Good footwork by Metapore, the junior forward. Sargian turns it around. Hiller is rushing back up into Holliston territory. Pavaka was looking along the sidelines for Delaney. Throw in for Holliston. Jake Ryan Kober, the senior. Now trying to take control is Pat Magia. Out of bounds it goes. Magia throws it in. Evan Katz. Back to Magia. Into the Hiller's zone. Trying to center it up in front of the box. Hopkinton takes back control. Is Pavaka able to get to it? But now here comes Metapore. Back and forth we go in the Hiller's defensive zone. Hopkinton finding themselves on defense throughout the most part of this first half so far. But they are defending very nicely. But the goal here is going to be to establish some kind of offensive momentum. Hillers certainly have the speed to keep up with this experienced Holliston team. In the center circle, it's Carter Mickelson. Back and forth we go, there's Cotting. Fires it towards the far sideline to Dohan. Into the corner, that is put out of bounds. There's Pecht matched up against Pucci and it appears they have called it out on Holliston. Check that, it is out on Hopkinton, Panthers corner kick. Come on, Red. Get up, Red. I thought it might have been Peck that got the last touch. The official right there with the action. A header in the box and then the bicycle kick there to get it out by Phil McCarthy, the junior. Hopkinton trying to take it down into Holliston territory, but the Panthers not letting it happen. There's Peck. Trying to establish control, and now Fargiano. Pass to Lind. Stolen away from Lind by Metapore. And that shot wide to the left. Zanini is set to clear it away. Big debate to start the season for Hopkinton. Who do you use in net? Niall Kelly or Tyler Zanini, two pretty good goalkeepers, and they felt like Zanini deserved the job, and he has done well in net so far this season. We'll recap the entire Hopkinton schedule up to this point in just a bit. But now the Panthers 
Right back into Hopkinton territory they go. Over to Johan. Johan with the fancy footwork on the right side of the box. The pass to center it up. A shot here by Kasarji and that's in. It's a goal for the Holliston Panthers. Dylan Kasarjian strikes at the 24-42 mark. 24-42 left to go in the first half and Holliston is on the board. A one nothing lead for the Panthers. Well, sooner or later, if you let this good shooting Holliston team get into your defensive zone too much, they are going to be able to break away and put a couple in. Hillers really are going to have to try to establish some kind of momentum in Holliston territory. Over to the far side now. We'll see if the Hillers start going to the right side of the field more as they have not had much success on the near side. Taking a look at the TVL boys soccer standings, Norton and Halston at the top of the pack, but Norton all the way at the top at 5-0, and oh, Halston 4-1, and one. Hillers 2-3, and three. Westwood 3-2-1, three, and one. Millis 1-3, one and three. Medfield 2-3. and three. Throw in from the far side, Hillers now on the attack. Bellingham 0-5, Ashland 2-2-1, Medway 3-0-1, Dover Sherborne 3-0-1, and Dedham 0-4-0. Put out of bounds along the far side. It is a throw in for Holliston. As they enjoy a nice 1-0 lead early in this first half. On the near side, Normando puts it down into Holliston territory. That is out of bounds. That went off of Cotting. Hiller's throwing. And it will be Holliston's ball. Thrown by Jake Ryan Kober. There's Johan. Cleared away by Normando. Into the center circle, pecked. Up the far side now. Rushing up towards the box is Keeney. It's out of bounds along the far side. Hiller's throw in. Bucci hanging back in the zone. Hillers get it to midfield. Holliston thought they would be right back on the attack, but a little bit of a breakaway there by Delaney, and then it's forced out of bounds. Hillers throwing along the near sideline. Normando. Towards midfield, Philip McCarthy, who has come on strong as of late for the Hillers, the junior defenseman. Listed as a defenseman, they put him all over the field. Back up by Heisel, the goalkeeper. Here comes Holliston once again. Panthers on the run. Pat Magia getting a little bit of space there. Free kick for Holliston. On the free kick, it is Griffin Dellen, the junior. Clock counting down towards 20 minutes, 30 seconds to go. Not much stoppage time so far in this first half is on the free kick. It'll be wrapped up by Zanini. And now Phil McCarthy on a little bit of a break. Pass up the near side. To Burns and some hard contact there as Cotting will rip it away and here come the Panthers. That one off of Soshka. Back towards the near side, Fargiano. And it's Delaney. There's Fargiano. Top of the circle now to the captain, Connor Delaney. Back to the far side. 
Tomlinson with an opportunity here. Has to get by two Panthers, and now a third comes in. That was just too many to handle, but the Hillers still have possession as Pavakad was able to sneak away with it. Into the Holliston box, and Owen Delaney was sneaking up behind the defender, and the goalkeeper Heisel saw it and wrapped it up. Hiller is showing a bit more aggression at getting into the attacking zone. Panthers on the throw and Jake Ryan Kober. For those of you just joining us, you're tuned in to Hopkinton Hillers Boys Bar City Soccer on HCAM. Dylan Kasarjian has made it a 1-0 Holliston lead with 24-42 left to go in the first half. About 19 minutes and counting now. Jake Ryan Kober on the throw in for Holliston. Goes over to Katz. Pass back to Pecht. Stolen away there by Pavakad. Holliston with an opportunity here. And that was at the top of the arc by Pecht. And the shot was to the left of Zanini. He's able to wrap it up. Down the far side by Delaney. Nice job, Red. Out of bounds, it goes. Panthers throwing. Clayton Boyce on the throwing. Into the box. A little push there by Kasarji, and that'll draw the whistle. Austin zone, cleared away by sophomore Mickelson. Panthers have certainly won the possession battle in this first half, but the Hillers, they've gotten a few uh, opportunities in the last few minutes and looking a little bit better in the attacking zone. Normando puts it at the top of the box. And now it'll roll right to the goalkeeper, Heisel. out of the danger zone by Fargiano, but now quickly on the rush, a two on one, as Pecht had the break there with Magia. Towards the near side, picked up by Delaney. Towards the far sideline, Connor Delaney turns it around. Now there's Fargiano. To the center circle of Pavakad, and he finds an open man on the left side. It's Owen Delaney, left side of the box, takes the shot on the ground and takes a hop just in front of Heisel, who's able to wrap it up. Good vision there by Delaney. And if that shot was just a little bit more to the left, that would have been right in the net. Approaching the 16 minute mark. Magia puts it up in the Hopkinton defensive zone. Here come the Hillers. Normando. Trying to pass across, but no one there. Carter Mickelson able to get it for Holliston. Now at the center circle, it's James Cruz. There's Mickelson, pass to the far side now. Put up by Boise. Skiba. And there is Mejia. Header in the center circle by Pavakad. Near side, Owen Delaney. Captain with some footwork there, but Metapore able to catch on. 
comes the Panthers. Kasarjian looking for another goal here. Left side of the box. Kasarjian versus Pucci. In the area, Connor Delaney. Delaney will get to it. And they are watching Kasarjian very closely. That's a great shot. Panthers with control. Made a poor. Up towards the corner of the box. Zanini will come out and wrap it up. On the near side. Just made a poor. Sargian. A lot of Hillers in the area. Too much for the two Panthers to handle. Nicely defended. Out of bounds along the near side. Go, Red. Well, the Hillers started off the season with a win at Ashland High School. And that was part of a boys girls doubleheader. Both Hillers teams were able to defeat Ashland in that doubleheader. And the Hopkinton boys won two to nothing as Captains Owen and Connor Delaney both scored second half goals. A little push there, but no whistle. Matt Bird has hopped into the game for the Hillers. Good friend of us over at HCAM has done a, quite a bit of volunteering for the HCAM channels. Happy to see him out there in the varsity soccer uniform getting some playing time. Certainly a player to look out for. He was called up from the JV squad recently. Here come the Panthers. Now Hiller's back on the attack. Skiba. Pass to Lind. Near side to McCarthy. Down over towards Roca. Pretty good box out there by Jake Ryan Kober on Roca. That'll draw the whistle with a little bit of contact being made and Hollison will get the chance to clear it away. After the season opening win against Ashland, the Hillers boys followed up with a three to two loss against a very good Medfield team. The Warriors scored all three goals in the second half. That would make them one and one after the first week of the season. Along the far side, it's Connor Delaney. Back and forth exchanges, but now the Hillers with an opportunity here. There's Matt Bird. That's up to Skiba. Now on the near side to Normando. Towards Delaney, who was in the arc, got turned away and put out of bounds along the near side, Hiller's throwing. In the second week of the season, the Hillers played on Monday, September 11th. That was a home game against a very good Medway team that's expected to go very far in the postseason this year. And Medway defeated Hopkinton four to nothing to make them one and two at that point. Out of bounds on Holliston. Tom Soka was trying to keep it in. Did not get to it in time. But no worries for Holliston there. Then the next uh, Hillers boys game, they lost to Westwood on the road, three to one. It was a tough uh, schedule to start off the season for the Hillers. And then they would play the next day against Westwood, get a t or uh, against Bishop Fian and get a one to nothing win. That was certainly a confidence booster after three losses in a row, breaking that losing streak with a win against a very good Bishop Fian team. And here we are today with the Hillers two and three overall. Holliston, of course, four and one. And this Panthers group, they have been together for the last couple of seasons. They started off 
playing together in their young high school years, so good experience for Holliston playing out there together. Corner kick here for the Hillers. And that will actually be a throw in. A 1 0 lead for Holliston. Less than 10 minutes left to go in this first half. We'll have a couple substitutions for the Panthers. Jake Heisel, the goalkeeper, set to air it out. Header by Lind. Pass over to Matt Bird. It's taken away by Katz. The goalkeeper will place it. Right up the middle he goes into the Hillers defensive zone and that forces an innie out of the net. Out of bounds along the far side, Holliston possession. Throw to the left of the box, off of Mickelson. Here come the Panthers. There's Katz. Out just in front of the box now to Maidapur, and a long shot there from the left corner of the box, and it is too long. Maidapur showing off the leg there. Lind, pass back to Normando. Out in front, now Pucci. Back to the far side he goes. Some nice footwork by Delaney. No Hillers in the area on the near side, but picking it up nicely is Normando. Hopkinton with an opportunity here. Here's Roca. Roca working his Way by a pair of Panthers over towards Bird, the shot, and that is going to be very long. Into the woods it goes by Skiba. That would have been a great field goal kick there. 7.15 and counting left to go, but it's nice to see the Hillers getting some momentum in the attacking zone and putting a little bit of pressure on this Panthers team. This game's still a long way from over. Hazel airs it out. Good spin around there by Magia. Header by Lind. There's Roca. Pass back to Skiba. Along the far side, Keeney. Hazel wraps it up. Airing it out. That one took a while to come down. Good boot there. Back and forth exchanges at midfield. Nicely done there by Bird. Halston now with possession, however, opportunity here. Is pecked, looking for a shot. Puts it behind him, over to Metapor. Taken away by Bird. Nicely done there, defensively there. By Matt Bird, Delaney on the near side, pass to Roca. Bird with the pass over to the right side, Skiba. Now top of the box. Panthers quick to get into defensive mode. Normando on the corner. Good move there. Three Panthers in front of him. Puts it over towards Bird. Now on the right side of the box, Tomlinson. And they pass over to Delaney. In the meantime, we get a whistle, and it is going to be in Panthers' favor. Approaching the five minutes mark left to go.
Asol airs it out. In the center circle. Now Tomlinson trying to take over on the far side. Into the box. There's Cotting. Now in the center circle, Normando. Joe Hunt to the near side. Jacobs. Two hillers in front of him. Nice slide there by Normando. Possession battle in the last few minutes has been in favor of the Hillers. Hopkinton coming on strong in these last few minutes of the first half. And Joe Hunt. Now Halston looking for a break here. As he uh, puts it into the box and it's wrapped up by Zanini. Airs it out. Header by Mickelson. There's Normando. Good give and go there between Normando and Lind. Cotting sacrificing his body there to keep it in Halston possession, but now the Hillers take it back and we'll have a whistle there. It looked like Magia might have got a piece of Delaney, but actually no, it's gonna be Halston's favor. Free kick, Cotting airs it out. Into the box, that was a beauty. And Zanini will swipe it out of the way. Out of bounds on the far side. This will be Hiller's favor, I believe, but it looks like we are going to have a timeout. 2.41 left to go in the first half. It's a 1-0 Halston lead on HCAN. Off the timeout, 2.41, according to the score clock. Left to go in the first half. They throw in for the Panthers on the far sideline. Turned away by Skiba. Booted up in the air by Delaney. Now Pecht coming on strong. Pass up to Johan. So Han with some good footwork along the sideline and he will shrug his shoulders as it ends up out of bounds and put his head back in disappointment. But it was some good footwork there. Roca. Put out by Pecht and a little push as well. That'll draw a whistle. Armando to Lind. Delaney, cross on the far side. Less than two minutes left to go in this first half, a one nothing Holliston lead. The Hillers have come on strong in these last few minutes and established some momentum. Panthers trying to get that momentum back to go into the halftime locker room. There's Pecht, pass up. That's over to Mejia. There's Johan, puts it across, kept out of the box by Delaney. Tomlinson gets by one and is able to put it into Holliston territory to Delaney speeding up the sideline on the right side of the box. Defender in front of him, looking up towards the arc and leaves it behind him for Skiba. And there's Roca. Two Panthers now in front of him. As Roca's trying to establish solid footing. Back to Normando, we have a whistle. Looks like it may be a free kick here for the Hillers and a very good opportunity. Let's go, White. Let's go, White. Let's go, White. Let's go, White. Justin Normando, the junior, airs it out. And that was a beauty off the goalkeeper's hands. Header by Tomlinson. Off Normando back to Tomlinson. Put behind him now. Pucci. Pass to Lind. There's Skiba.
Gucci airs it out. Header in the midfield section by Skiba. Here come the Panthers. Sargian with a nice pass behind him to Metaphor. Now towards the arc. Nicely done by the Hillers defenseman. Down the far sideline. Cleared away by Hazel. And that is going to do it for the first half of play. After one half, it is Halston one, Hopkinton nothing. You are tuned in to Hopkinton Hillers Boys Varsity Soccer on HCAM. Welcome back to Field 13 at Hopkinton High School. We are ready for the second half between the Hopkinton Hillers and the Halston Panthers. It's Boys High School Varsity Soccer on HCAM. Matt Clark on camera, Tom Nappy on the call, and we are underway in the second half. Halston leading Hopkinton one to nothing. The only goal of the game was scored by Dylan Kasarjian. About 16 minutes into action here at field 13. The Hillers came on strong towards the end of the first half and looked a whole lot better than they did to start the game and put some good pressure on the Panthers. And we'll see if they can continue that momentum they had going into the halftime locker room. Hillers will now have to work left to right. Back and forth exchanges to start off this second half. Aired out into Halston territory. Out of bounds along the far side. It will be a Hiller's throw in. Justin Normando on the entry. And a good battle along the sideline. We'll get a whistle there with some body contact. We'll go in favor of the Hillers. Airs it out right into the box. And that will force Hazel out from goal. He will wrap it up. There's a nice free kick by Peyton Burns. And we'll have a whistle at midfield in favor of Holliston. Free kick for Tyler Cotting. Airs it out. And a header out by the defenseman, Mac Lind. Up the far side come the Hillers. Back and forth exchanges at midfield once again. Hillers back into their defensive zone. Holliston trying to establish some momentum. It will be a throw in from the far sideline. Pat Mejia. Strong leg there at the top of the arc, but wide to the left from Evan Katz. Tyler Zanini airs it out towards his right. A header by Mac Lind. Panthers trying to establish control as Keeney got in there to take it away. Now on the far side is Soka. He's back up to Katz. And now at midfield is Mickelson. There's Cotting towards Keeney. Here comes the Hillers. Rushing upfield is 
McCarthy. Put it in the box, but no one there for the Hillers. Hazel airs it out. Pucci gets it out of the box. There's Pecht. Up the far sideline. Good break here. Connor Delaney. And put out of bounds. Throw in for Pavakad. Now, Normando will put it back towards the near side. There's Pucci. It's up to Lind. That one off of Kasarjian from Skiba. McCarthy along the sideline, and he will put it out of bounds off of Keeney. They call it out, actually, on McCarthy. Halston throwing. Header out in front by Pucci. Sargent and Lind get wrapped up. That'll draw a whistle. And this is going to be a big opportunity here for Holliston. They will have the free kick right in front of the box. Pat Magia, the junior, will take it. Magia to Katz. Better by the defenseman to get it out. It was Pucci, still in the danger zone. Hiller's trying to rush it back into Holliston territory. That was a pass from Burns towards the near side. Push there, no whistle. That was a good check by Delaney. Pecked with the takeaway. Far side he goes. He's looking for a Metaport. Metaport tripped up, and Delaney able to get to it. A lot of midfield exchanges to start off this second half. About 33 minutes left to go. That one put out of bounds by Clayton Boise. Throw in for the Hillers. Philip McCarthy, the junior, will take it. Down in the box, and that was Delaney rushing in, looking for the shot. Made a pour on the far side. And Forgiano trying to take it away. Out of bounds it goes. Hillers throw in. Hopkinton continuing their momentum from the last few minutes of the first half as they have certainly won the possession battle so far in this half. And this is going to be a throw in for Holliston from the far side. Trying to clear their territory, but the Hillers have it. Delaney was looking for an opportunity, and that opportunity ends up being diverted to, towards the near side by Evan Katz. Get it out, Red. Get it out. Phil McCarthy will take the throw in for the Hillers. There it is, into the box. That one is put up field. By the Panthers, it was Keeney. And now it's McCarthy up the sideline towards Burns. Out of bounds it goes off of Burns. Holliston throwing. Clayton Boise takes it over to Keeney. There's Pecht. Top of the circle now to Magia. 
Alston with possession. Good exchanges at midfield. Both of these teams, certainly an even matchup today. Corner of the box, Pucci puts it out of bounds. Throw in for Holliston. Here come the Panthers. And that one will force an innie out. From the near side, that was Keeney on the shot attempt. Put back in a Holliston territory. Less than 30 left to go in regulation. Come the Panthers. Looking out in front, an opportunity here to the right, that's in. Carter Mickle, and that goal is scored by Brandon Keeney. The senior able to put it to the right of Zanini for the goal. A wide open opportunity, makes it two nothing Halston. It comes at the 11 minute mark or so. And now the Hillers really have their work cut out for them. Alston looking for another one. There's Kasarjian. On the arc, Hillers having trouble clearing it out. Some good footwork there, and now we'll have a whistle as Peck tries to maintain possession. And this is going to be against Hopkinton. Bill McCarthy not too happy about it. Huge opportunity for Holliston to really take control of this game. Free kick right in front. Well, it was a great cross pass to Keeney who was lined up in the box and he took advantage of the open opportunity to make it two to nothing Holliston. And now a chance to make it three. That was right at Zanini, and he is able to wrap it up. That was a great save. A nice job by the sophomore goalkeeper. That shot was a bullet from Pecht. Had her back into the defensive zone. Up the far side. Throw in for the Hillers. Holliston will get a chance to clear it away. Jake Heisel, the junior goalkeeper. At midfield now. Left side of the box. 
And a collision there between Tyler Cotting and Peyton Burns. And will certainly draw a whistle. Halston will be able to clear it out. Twenty-five, forty-five, and counting. Left in this second half. A two-nothing Halston lead. Nicholson puts it behind him. Hazel. Header by McCarthy. Out of bounds it goes. Throw in for the Panthers. Couple substitutions for Holliston as Boise inbounds it. Pass by Magia there. Back and forth exchanges in the midfield section. Now trying to break away was Matapur. Taken back by the Hillers. Bargiano towards the center circle. There's Delaney on a break. Opportunity here. Left side of the box, looking for the shot, and it is just a little bit high. Good opportunity and ball distribution there by the Hillers, but it didn't turn out the way they wanted it. Alston will clear it away. Hazel airs it out. Below 24 minutes left to go now. Out of bounds along the, or a whistle rather, is going to give the Hillers a free kick. Airs it out right into the box. Scooped up by Hazel. Airs it out. Jonathan Pecht. Pass to the far side to Evan Johan. Evans a pass back up along the sideline to Pat Magia. Now back towards the corner into the box. Put back out by Delaney. Hiller is working their way up the far side. Vaca trying to establish control. No one there for the Hillers as Cotting gets to it. Now Johan. Out of bounds it goes. It will be a Hillers throw in. 22, 16 and counting. Few substitutions made on both sides. Out along the far side, that was off of Jake Ryan Cober. Hopkinton throw in. Strong shot from the left side of the box, but wide to the left goes Delaney. Hazel set to air it out. Header at midfield by Pecht. Up in the air by McCarthy, back towards midfield. Oh, 
We'll have a whistle in favor of Holliston. Panthers play on, trying to catch the Hillers off guard. Magia along the far sideline. Loses his footing briefly, but quickly back up into the box. It goes, a header, and that is just wide to the left. A good opportunity by the Panthers, and a nice job by Maidapur, but just puts it a little bit too far to the left side. Zanini. Towards the near sideline of Elga Bry. That's out of bounds. Halston throw in. Boise on the entry. Left side of the box now. Taken back by the Hillers. Nicely defended. Magia trying to establish control once again for Holliston. Put back up by Lind. Less than 20 minutes of regulation left to go. Left side of the box, Delaney looking for the shot. And Tyler cutting all over Delaney there. And they are certainly watching Owen Delaney very closely. They know what a threat he is. Tyler Cotting having some words with the official. I don't think he liked uh, how Owen Delaney was making a little bit of contact there. It looked like from here that both players were making a bit of contact. Good matchup on the far side of the field throughout this game. Up along the sideline, Ormando. And he's tripped up, ends up out of bounds. Halston ball. <laughs> Header was by Macklin. Back out of bounds it goes. This time it's Hiller's possession. Towards midfield. Lind puts it over to McCarthy. That was off of Magia. Now Halston with control. Cotting. Or check that. That was packed. Pass over to the corner. And a great steal along the far side. Here come the Hillers. That was nicely done by Normando, who was able to keep it away from Kasargian with some fancy footwork. Out in front now is Pucci. An opportunity here, the shot kept on the ground. Not much leverage there by Brandon Keeney, who had to quickly get that one off with three Hillers in front of him. Nice job getting that opportunity, however. Pecht puts that one off of Pucci. Hillers have it now. Elgabri. Panthers back on the attack. Stolen away, here comes McCarthy. Philip McCarthy puts it up the sideline over to Owen Delaney. Into the box. An opportunity here. Two defenders in front. The shot deflected by a defenseman. Still in play. And it is cleared out by Cotting. But now Delaney going to try to launch it back in. Nice work by the Panthers defense. Hopkinton still a threat as Pavakad comes down with possession. Over to Burns. Back and forth exchanges in the Hillers attack zone. That one off of Elgabri. There's Keeney. 
Up the sideline he goes with it. And that is going to remain in play. Nate Pucci will put it back into Holliston territory. Panthers quick to take back control. The give and go here, left side of the box. Zanini comes out and wraps it up. Nice play by the goalkeeper as Mejia was rushing in quick. Fifteen thirty and counting left in regulation. Put out of bounds along the far side. Throw in opportunity here. Philip McCarthy, the junior. Airs it out into the box, a couple of headers, and it is wrapped up by Hazel. Header by Pecht. Here comes Hopkinton, Elgabri, up the sideline. And now quickly rushing in is Delaney. Cotting clears it away. Below 14.30 left to go in regulation. It's Hiller's boys varsity soccer on H cam. Tom Nappy on the call. A 2-0 lead for Holliston. Hopkinton 2 and 3 on the season. Holliston 4 and 1. Kept in play there by Kasarjian, who sends it long. Now Pucci hangs that one. Peck trying to establish control. Pass to Mejia. Good footwork there. Back towards midfield now. Boise sends it down now. Hiller's trying to establish control. Is Mustafa Elgavri does a nice job at keeping it away from Keeney. Along the far side. Pass up by Skiba, looking for Elgavri. Out of bounds it goes. Throw in for the Panthers on the near side corner. Clayton Boise, the senior. The throw in is taken by Delaney. And he was looking for the shot there and Heisel was ready for it. Approaching 12 minutes left in regulation. Hillers need to get something going here. They are quickly running out of time. Midfield by Delaney. And we'll get a whistle there. That one was out. Throw in for the Hillers. Delaney on the entry. Nice pass Bavakad and over towards Burns. And now the corner of the box. It's Tomlinson back to Burns. Burns against two Panthers there is tripped up, but it will end up out of play. It is going to be in Holliston's favor. We'll have a 
a substitution for the Panthers. Jonathan Peck back into the game for Zachary Jacobs. Hazel airs it out. Header by Lind. Pass back to Normando. Hopkinton trying to establish control in Halston territory. Skiba. Nicely cleared away by Griffin Dillon. Out of bounds along the near sideline. Tomlinson able to get it to Skiba. Up the sideline goes Tomlinson. No one there for the Hillers to pick it up. Back at midfield now. Pecked looking for a breakaway. Top of the box. And this is Soshka looking for the shot. Nicely defended by McCarthy. There's Tomlinson on the near side. It's taken away by Boise. Delaney turns it around, and now Hallison has it back. Made a pour, sends it right to the box. Cleared away by McCarthy. Here come the Panthers. Halston putting the pressure on. Just below the nine minute mark now. Panthers will have the entry. First, it looks like we'll have a substitution. Back into the game is Kasarjian. Eight thirty and counting. Not a whole lot of stoppage time in the second half. Halston has scored a goal in each half. First one came 16 minutes into the first half by Dylan Kasarjian, or about 16 minutes into the first half. And then the second one, about 11 minutes into this half. That one wrapped up by Zanini. Along the far side. Peck trying to turn it around. Normando chases it down, puts that up the sideline. Out of play it goes. Panthers throwing. Header back towards the sideline and out. Panthers entry. Up towards midfield. A header by Tomlinson. Hopkinton going to try for an attack here. Skiba. Gets it up to Delaney. Immediately getting in the way of Delaney is Keeney. Here come the Hillers. Burns with the shot, and it is right off the post. 
Peyton Burns, a good shot there, but just a tad too far to the left. And this one will force Hazel out. He'll wrap it up. Peyton Burns would certainly like to have that one back. Now at six minutes left. Time running out. Here comes Halston. Pecked along the far side. Hailers get it back. Kavaka. Now Burns. Hiller's trying to establish control, Lind. Pass to Favakad. Out of bounds on the far side, Normando on the throw in. Delaney. And as he takes it towards the end line, we have a whistle. Holliston throwing. Pair of headers there. Mac Lind. To the corner of the box now. Centered up and kept out by Keeney. To the near side, Delaney. Nice footwork by Kasarjian. There's Skiba up against Pecht. Jonathan Pecht trying to take over there, but too many hillers in the area. Delaney, the pass up, and it's taken back by Cotting. Wrapped up by Zanini. There's Pucci over to Delaney. Up the sideline of Skiba. That one back towards Burns. Excuse me, McCarthy now to Burns. Over to the far sideline. Corner of the box, it's Pavakad, nicely defended. Cotting puts it down the sideline and out it goes. Throw in for Philip McCarthy. About three minutes left to go in the second half. Throw in for the Panthers. Header along the sideline. Kept in play. Delaney with possession. And a good steal by Magia. Out of bounds it goes. Halston throwing. Cleared away by Cotting. There's Pecht. Into the Hillers defensive zone. Delaney. Matched up with Kasarjian and Kasarjian wins that battle, has possession. Coming up strong, and it's stolen back by Delaney. Good matchup throughout this afternoon, watching Delaney and Kasarjian battle against each other. Two very good soccer players. Less than two minutes left to go of regulation. 
2-0 lead for Holliston. Good footwork by Gia, but Killers will take it back. Back and forth exchanges in the midfield zone. To the near side it goes. Was Delaney out in front looking for an opportunity there, but Cotting able to clear it away. Chased down by Pucci. Now it's Zanini coming out of the net, and he'll pass it over to McCarthy. Up the far sideline he goes. And a smart move there, putting it back towards Hazel, burning some time off the clock with very little time left to go. Here's Pecht. Down the far sideline, up towards the corner, still in play. Good battle along the sideline there and we'll have a whistle now as it ends up out. And this is going to be in favor of the Hillers. And we might have had a warning on the far side for one of the players. Delaney up towards Skiba. Here comes Skiba. And that's put down by Cotting, and that will do it. The Holliston Panthers are going to defeat the Hopkinton Hillers by a final score of two to nothing. A nice effort by the Hillers against a very good Holliston team. It was a good defensive battle between these two TVL teams in a very competitive game. The Hillers had a couple opportunities they just could not take advantage of. And they will fall to two and four on the season. Holliston is now five and one overall. For Matt Clark on camera, I'm Tom Nappy. We thank you for watching this HCAM broadcast of Hopkinton Hillers Varsity Boys Soccer. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care, and we'll talk to you soon.